Hey everybody, Walt Biscardi back with you for another quick lesson on color and this time I want to show you the auto balance feature in the primary in room uh, where color goes ahead and pretty much sets up your scene for the way it thinks it should be balanced. Sort of kind of similar in Final Cut Pro when you can click a white area in the three-way color corrector to set your colors based on white in the screen. Now to make this easier over here in my user press I'm going to turn off the monochrome scopes and in the scope make sure you have parade selected overlay is the uh, default just switch it over to parade and now we can clearly see the red the green and the blue and we can see that there's a lot more red in this picture than the other two there's a lot more red especially up in the higher end we go up here to primary in and down here in the lower right there is a button called auto balance simply click that and you notice how my picture up here suddenly now has a lot of blue in it and we can see that reflected very clearly on the scopes that the red more or less stayed the same the blue has really been pushed up the thing about it is if you want to make some changes to this you're not really sure what color just did I can, I'll go back down here and I'll hit reset primary in and notice this screen right here notice all of these elements on the screen I'm gonna hit auto balance one more time you notice how nothing happened over here we're not really sure what color just did to our scene well actually if we switch over to the advanced tab here are all the changes that color just made so if you want to adjust the balance based on what color thought it should be this is where you make your changes I'm gonna hit reset primary in one more time you can see how everything is one 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 the blue lift is zero all the lifts are zero everything else is one now I'll hit auto balance one more time there are all of the changes that color had just made now if you have a mouse with a middle click or in my case I have a tablet where I have mapped the eraser to be the middle click I can simply click inside these boxes and now go left and right to start making changes to these colors just by middle clicking I'll go here to the green left and bring that down so once color's gone ahead and done the auto balance for you if you want to tweak it and not happy with the way it did that balance you can simply come over here especially if you've got a mouse with a middle click or just map the eraser on the tablet or something else on the tablet to be middle click you can start playing with this to your heart's content there you go another quick tip on color